Hello friends, so in today's session, I'm going to explain you uh, how to restore VM snapshot. In a previous session, I explained you how to take the snapshot. So in today's session, I'm going to show you how to restore that snapshot. Okay, fine. So uh, I already also explained you why we are taking the snapshot because suppose if you're doing any major activity on your system. So before that, you can take the snapshot. Like if suppose something will go wrong, you can revert back. From the previous stage okay so this is my vCenter so let me log into my vCenter okay in your case you have to uh, when you log into your vCenter you have to use your credential like your username and password okay so yeah so you, this is my vCenter and you can see uh, as of now here only one VM is there that VM name is Terra Terraform but in your case like when you working in working in any organization so maybe you know, like uh, it's a multiple vms like more than thousands vm right so it's uh, very difficult to drop down and you can find so what you have to do you can search the vm with the vm name so you can copy the vm name and then you can paste in a search box so in in my case it's showing here but in your case it will show here also okay so you can paste then it will be drop down and then you can click on that your vm so means you select your VM. So in, I'm selecting this my VM. So so what and then next step what you have to do you have to power off your VM. So before you restoring from the snapshot you power of the power of the VM. Okay. Now so before I'm going to restore from the snapshot let me show you here something. So you can see this is my uh, server which one I'm going to restore from the snapshot. It's a, it's showing inactive here and uh, this logs directory today i created just now i created few uh, minutes back why because i want to show you here for testing like once i will revert back from the snapshot this directory will be not available because i created today and i'm going to restore the uh, snapshot like previous day <coughs> so this will be not available okay i will show you that one so let me go to the uh, vcenter and once you select a v, uh, VM, then what you have to do, you have to right mouse click and then you have to go to the snapshot option and then click on the manage snapshot. Once you click on the manage snapshot, it will show you here like list of the snapshot. If you have one snapshot one, or you or you have if you multiple snapshot, it will show here. So you have to click this, click on the snapshot. Once you click on the snapshot, it will show you the details of snapshot when it was taken you can see six, it's a few days back i taken this snapshot so that this is showing here and the description and name so everything it will show here okay so you have to select the snapshot like which snapshot you're going to restore and then click on the restore snapshot once you click on the restore snapshot this message will be show so it mean like you can read this message and it will show here also the your snapshot name so you can see it's a showing that restore snapshot before activity date. This is my snapshot name. So it's a showing here. So it means I'm going to restore uh, this system with this snapshot. Okay. And then you have to click on the restore. Once you click on the restore, then you can close this, uh, close this uh, menu, this uh, which one you open. And once you close, then you can click on the your VM power on. You can click on the power on. Once you click on the power, you have to wait for a few minutes. So like let let them uh, system boot. So see, it's a way. Uh, if I want, I can easily I can show you like right mouse click and go snapshot and restore. But I'm explaining you more and more details. Like you know, so you will get the clear understanding. Like uh, how to restore and restore when you're restoring which process things we have to uh, like you know keep it in mind. So those things also is very important. Okay. So that's why I'm explaining everything. You can see now it's a login prompt is showing. So let me log into the system here. Now, this is my system. Let me restart here. Yeah. Let me give my password. Okay, so I'm able to log in here. Let me type uptime. So you can see zero minutes is showing. Now, let me go to the my home directory. Okay, now type L. So now you can see log directory is not here right which one i told you right so like because today i was created this one and i now i restored from the snapshot so this one this is not available here okay so 
I hope uh, you like this video because I explain uh, each and every steps like when you are restoring which things, uh, which things you have to keep it in your mind. Okay. So please, if you like this video, please like, uh, subscribe and share. Thanks for your watching.